Welcome back everyone, this is Rachel Doe back with another video. This was our first trip to Dollywood and the drive out there is stunning through the mountains. We stayed at the Dreammore Resort and I'm going to be showing you around the resort in this video. If you want to see my room tour, check out my channel, that video has already been posted. Out behind the pool there were these beautiful butterfly benches amongst the flowers and we saw people out here relaxing especially at night having a glass of wine so it's a really nice place to just relax now the swimming pool it's not huge but it is really well made because it has all these curvy alcoves they have life jackets available and a water refill which is a really nice touch they do have food and drink service around the pool as well now behind the pool, they do have the s'mores hour in the evening. I brought my own vegetarian marshmallows, but they do provide you everything and that was so much fun. Speaking of sweet treats, you can also get the cinnamon bread at the Dream More, which we loved having with some black coffee for breakfast. There is an ATM available if you need it. There's also a spa at the Dream More, and the prices are pretty much on par with a hotel spa, but they're definitely not Vegas, Miami prices. They're a little bit more expensive than you're going to pay in your regular salons. There's also an indoor pool, which is nice. It's pretty small, but since Tennessee will get cold for half the year, it's a nice option as well. Definitely take your time around the resort looking at all the little details and placards and touches. There's some really cool stuff in there. This is the restaurant. We did not end up eating in here, but the vibe is so cute and hometowny. Another nice touch is at the end of the hallways, there was a water refill and the cleanest hotel ice machine I've ever seen. Also a microwave and some space to make some food if you have a special diet, which is another great detail. Now there is a game room too, so if you're there on maybe a bad weather day and you need to entertain the kids, this is the spot you want to head to after the indoor pool. We were only there a couple days, so we didn't use the fitness center, but here's a quick look at that. are the daily activities from when we were there. Staying at the Dream War, you also get a shuttle to the park and the water park. It is a bit rickety since you're in the mountains, but it was super convenient just like having this time saver pass from staying at the resort. One more benefit to staying at the Dream War is they do have the market downstairs. This is a grab and go. They have Starbucks coffee, freestyle machine, all sorts of bottled and packaged foods. So if you need to grab some snacks, they have a lot of options. cream here which is great for after the hot day at the park and there is a pizza kitchen as well they were able to make me an allergy friendly pizza which was great and it was just nice to have an easy dinner one night after the park overall we had a very nice stay at the dream or resort let me know if you have any questions in the comments